Section 10 of Little Pillows or Good Night Thoughts for Little Ones by Francis Ridley Havergal. This LibriVox recording is in the public domain. Ninth Day Asking Ask what I shall give thee. Second Chronicles 1 7. There had been a grand day in Israel. The young King Solomon had spoken to all the people, and to all the great men and captains and governors, and they had followed him to the tabernacle of the Lord, and he had gone up to the brazen altar which Bezaleel had made nearly five hundred years before, and had offered a thousand burnt offerings. In that night, when it was all over, and Solomon was quiet and alone, did God appear unto Solomon, and said unto him, Ask what I shall give thee. And Solomon took God at his word, and asked at once for what he felt he wanted most. And God kept his word, and gave him at once what he asked, and promised him a great deal more besides. This is the message to you tonight, ask what I shall give thee. Think what you most want, and ask for that for Jesus Christ's sake. You need not, like Solomon, ask for only one thing. You want many things, and you may ask for them all. And God will give. He always does give to the real askers, more than you ask, more than you ever thought of asking. Perhaps you say, I don't know what to ask. Then begin by asking him to show you by his Holy Spirit what you really want, and to teach you to ask for it. Then you say, will he give me whatever I ask? Well, if you ask something which is not good for you, he loves you too much to give you that. But he will give you something better. But if you ask for something that he has promised to give, you may be quite certain he will give it you. Remind your Heavenly Father of his promises, as Solomon did, verse 9. And you may ask and expect the answer at once, like Solomon, who said, Now, O Lord God, and give me now. Then listen to God's message, and now, this very evening, ask him for some of his promised gifts. And when you lie down, try to think of the different things which he has promised, and which you want and turn every thought into the prayer, Give me now, for Jesus Christ's sake. Thou art coming to a king, large petitions with thee bring, for his grace and power are such, none can ever ask too much. End of section 10